Hi everybody, how are you today? I'm very happy to be here with you. It's a pleasure for me to be guiding you, to be teaching you, to be helping you with the knowledge in English. So remember, this is the program Vamos para la Universidad. This is English One and we have been working so hard uh, because uh, now we are in the third unit and this is the first class of that, excuse me, the second class of the first week. This is the first week, and remember that the name of this week is a birthday party. But additionally, of birthday party, we are going to be talking additionally about carnivals, celebrations, uh, festivities that you have in your towns. At the end of the class, you are going to let me know about the festivity that you have in your towns, in your places, and you are going to invite us with a poster, and that's going to be a very good work. So... Welcome to Maria Amparo Grajales eh, from Amalfi and the and the students from there. Hello Amalfi, eh, Institución Educativa Darío Gutiérrez, eh, Institución Educativa F. Gómez from Begachi. So and I'm going to be saying hello or greeting you while you are participating. So Uh, we are going to start and welcome again. Special green for you, for all my students there, my colleagues and all the people who can watch this video or this class or this class offline. Uh, first of all, can, can you identify these festivals? I'm going to show you a list of festivals and you are going to let me know if you can identify them. First of all, Can you identify this one? Which festival is this one? Hello. Oh my God. Let me choose a different color. Which is this festival? Which one is this? Is it Carnaval de Barranquilla? Is it um, white or black and white people festival from, from Pasto? What is it? Or do you want me to help you this first time? Okay, I'm going to help you this first time. This festival or this carnival or this festivity is Feria de las Flores. And it happens here in Medellin. It's a very traditional party. It is Feria de las Flores in Medellin. Sometimes we can say, we can use the name in parentheses or in a few, and we can say this is the Flower Festival. This is the name in which many people uh, offer this festivity to foreign people or visitors from different cities from here, from Medellin. Uh, here, uh, Institución Educativa F. Gómez, no, it says, here is Inego. Is, Inego is the name of that party or what, or that festivity or that carnival. Let us know. So, oh. I'm going to continue. Um, can you identify this one? What is this? Where does it take place? In El Peñol, in Medellín, in Jardín, in Sopetran, in Remedios, in Begachi. What is that? What is this festivity or what is this carnival? Can you identify it? Lo pueden identificar. Si de pronto alguno lo identifica, me deja saber y pensará. Eh, ¿De dónde es esa fiesta que yo la he visto que se visten así? Más o menos reconozco estos balcones. ¿De dónde serán? Eh, yo he estado en ese town y no me acuerdo. Begachi, hello, welcome. Yeah, welcome. We are identifying this picture if you know what kind of festivity or what kind of, of traditional party it's it. Okay, this is a town. This is a town here in Antioquia. All of them are towns. And this one is Feria de la Rosa in Jardín. Rose Festival in Jardín. Jardín, I think it's a very cute town. It's like three hours from Medellín, but it's a beautiful place. Look at the houses. They are really, really beautiful. So, I have been to Jardin and I think it's romantic. Uh, I think there they have some panela, they have some fish, like truchas. Uh, it's 
what I remember from that. Uh, okay, we are going to continue. Which one? Which one is this? I'm going to describe it. They are, there are three people. They are working. Maybe they are mining. They are kind of... The color is like kind of gold. Gold. So, do you, do you know this festival? Do you know this festival? Hey, ¿qué pasa con la participación, muchachos? ¿Cierto? Am I talking alone? No. Los que me saludan. Present, María Amparo. A ver, ¿qué pasa? Institucional Catia F. Gómez. Sandra. Institucional Catia Darío Gutiérrez. What happened? It's a mind festival. Very good, María Amparo. Very good. So, this is a mind... I'm going to let you know about the about the, the name and this is It's Fiesta del Oro y la Minería en Remedios It's Mining and Gold Festival in Remedios Remedios is a place here in Antioquia uh, Yeah, it's in Remedios Thank you very much, María Amparo uh, So, a traditional carnival This is part of Actividad introductoria. Objetivo. Identificar ideas acerca de las fiestas tradicionales del municipio de nuestros personajes. Instruction. Read and listen to the following conversation between Daniel and José. You will find information about traditional carnivals in their towns. Primero lo vamos a escuchar a ver qué logramos entender. Y eso de que lo escuchemos yo le voy a hacer unas preguntitas a ver. Y luego ya sí lo vamos a leer. Listo, entonces... First of all, we are going to listen to the audio, nada más lo vamos a escuchar, y después we are going to read it, ok? Eh, let's go. Actividad, Actividad introductoria. A traditional carnival. carnival. Instruction. Read, read the, the following conversation, conversation between Daniel and Jose. You will find information about traditional carnivals in their hometown. Wow, our traditional town carnival is great. Why? Is there anything new? I think it's boring. Oh no, look at this poster. It sounds great. Amazing, I love birds. I think it is fantastic to have a bird watching contest. But I think there is a problem. Why? Do you need some binoculars? I can lend you a pair. Do not worry about that. Now, my friend, the problem is that the carnival is in two weeks. Oh no, is it the same date as Fernanda's birthday party? We can't miss our friend's party, can we? No, we can't. I prefer to stay with her. This is very important to her. I agree. Next year we can participate at our town carnival. Okay, that will be great. Bye. See you tonight. Okay. What is the problem they find there? What are they talking about? Hey, Jimmy Rendon, welcome. There is a problem. There is a problem be because there are two activities. Catherine and the students, welcome. Welcome, it's a pleasure to have you here. Uh, in a moment I'm going to play the audio again. So, we are going to play the audio and at the same time we are going to be reading the lyrics. While we... Oh, I'm sorry, it was my fault. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I closed the audio and now it's okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, hello, Jimmy Rendon. Hello, Catherine. Uh, welcome, and we have Institucional Catia F. Gomez from Begachi. Now, what we are going to do is we are going to try to answer this question. What's the problem with in, the, in this? What's the problem? Oh, what's the problem there? Pudieron identificar cuál era el problema del que nos hablaban en el, en el audio que, que iba a pasar, iban a pasar dos cosas al mismo tiempo. What's, what's the problem there? Do you know? Ok. Yes, Jimmy, let me know. What's the problem? O María Amparo, a ver, what's the problem before I play the audio again? Fernanda's party. Oh, very good. That's a problem. Okay, I don't know if it's the problem, but the problem is that 
the carnival or the festival and the party, they are gonna be the same day. Y se acuerdan que ya habíamos hablado en la clase pasada de la fiesta que estaba planeando Fernanda. Y el carnival es son en la misma fiesta. Ustedes a cuáles irían? Al festival or carnival o a Fernanda's party. Y si Fernanda es la novia de uno, hmm, no, le tocó ir donde Fernanda uno, ¿cierto? Que no va. Right. So Fernanda, ah, Jimmy and the students, they choose Fernanda. Very good. Uh, so, I'm going to play the audio again, and at the same time, I'm going to show you the conversation, right? Uh, of course, Fernanda's party, Marian Paro Grajales, right? So, I'm, listen because, listen and try to read because in a moment I'm going to check your understanding with four basic questions. So, Again, I'm going to play the, the audio again, and at the same time, I'm going to pause these slides, right? Actividad introductoria. A traditional carnival. Instruction. Read the following conversation between Daniel and Jose. You will find information about traditional carnivals in their hometown. Wow, our traditional town carnival is great! Why? Is there anything new? I think it's boring. Oh no, look at this poster. It sounds great. Amazing. I love birds. I think it is fantastic to have a bird watching contest. But I think there is a problem. Why? Do you need some binoculars? I can lend you a pair. Do not worry about that. Now, my friend, the problem is that the carnival is in two weeks. Oh no. Is it the same date as Fernanda's birthday party? We can't miss our friend's party, can we? No, we can't. I prefer to stay with her. This is very important to her. I agree. Next year we can participate at our town carnival. Okay, that will be great. Bye. See you tonight. Okay, so the questions are what is the celebration? Where? That's the first question. We have four questions. This is number one. This is number three. This is number three. This is number four. The first question. Hi, Ricardo. Welcome. We have new participants. We have uh, Angela, Ricardo, Catherine, Jimmy Rindon, Jaime Oriol Ochoa, oh, Sandra. And ya las que, y las que habíamos mencionado ahorita. Hello Ricardo, hi everybody. So, what is the celebration based on the audio, based on what you read? What is the celebration? Oh, there are two celebrations. Let me know. Hi Ricardo. So, where, donde? What is the celebration? The second question. What kind of events are there in the municipality? Number three. What other event happens at the same time? And number four, who is the sing, who is singing at the festival? A ver, los, los compañeros, los que se van integrando, a ver, ¿qué, qué lograron entender? Cualquier cosita. Si me están prestando atención, because, you know, I see there is not a lot of participation from you at this point. So, hello teacher, we have some problems with the internet. I'm sorry, Angela. Right? Oh, uh, okay, I'm going to try to solve this because maybe some of you are having some issues with the internet connection, but you know, I think you should participate more, right? Un jaloncito orejas a los que casi no me están participando allá, right? What is the celebration? Okay, there are two kinds of celebrations. The first one is the festival, which is about fruits and birds. And the second one is the, it's Fernanda's party, right? So there are two celebrations, a birthday party and a carnival festival. Second question, what kind of events are in the, in the municipality? Okay, it's about fruits and birds, birds or birding watching, and that's the first. And in a moment we are going to read, what other events happens at the same time? There's Fernanda's party and the carnival. Who is singing at the festival? Entonces, para le cantar en esta, para ver en esta, entonces nos vamos a regresar al póster. Y yo les voy a dar dos minutos 
para que ustedes lo lean y traten de entender todo lo que más puedan sobre este festival que es, carnival que se llama Welcome to Our 32nd Bird and Fruit Carnival, que es un póster invitando a una al, al carnaval de, las, de los pájaros y las flores, que es la edición número 32 o 32 segunda edición de este festival entonces miren que comienza por ejemplo así we are glad to invite you estamos complacidos, complacidos de invitarlos entonces les voy a dar dos minutos para que lo lean right a ver qué logran entender ahí yo sé que algunas palabritas que no entendemos pero ahorita vamos a trabajar eso two minutes to work I'm going to read and at the same time I'm going to be explaining what's happening with this poster invitation, right? Welcome to our 32nd Bird and Fruit Carnival. We are glad to invite you to come to our great town. Estamos complacidos de invitarlo a que vengas a nuestro maravilloso pueblo. In this edition, we have a lot of events planned. Birding is an, in our town is an unforgettable experience. Hard boring, albergando over 100 species of birds. Más de 100 peces, más de 100 especies de pájaros están albergando en esta festividad. Ir a observar toda esa cantidad de maravillosos de, de, de pájaros. Uh, our town is considered the nest of Antioquia. Nest, un nido, entonces es considerado el nido de Antioquia. With red capping mannequins, saltarines de capa roja. Eh, yellow Beard and Turkish Cotigan. Cotigan son una especie de pájaros turqués. And the world famous Scarlet Macaws. Entonces este es como un guacamayo escarlata. We offer one of the most spectacular experiences in Antioquia. August 28th, 2016. This activity takes place across the whole town. Entonces en todo el pueblo, the whole town. Matt And obstacles run for families. Mat, la primera palabrita ahí es barro. Entonces, an obstacle run for families. Una carrera de barro y obstáculos para las familias. We are the only race, la única carrera. In, a, in Antioquia, where kids, donde los niños, run the same course along their parents. Entonces, corren también lo mismo que los papás, los niños. So, sign up for the best mat run. We have everything for the newbie Para los novatos Como por ejemplo Me encantaría Mira, es una carrera de barro Wow, it would be amazing Entonces tenemos todo para los novatos O para los nuevos Like articles from race directors Info on the race An equipment for race day Kids age 6 and up Entonces esto me pone muy feliz. Aceptan niños de 6 en adelante. Entonces yo puedo, ¿cierto? Soy un niño de más de 6 años. And you too, you can do it as well. Six kids, ages and up, can participate with their parents. Recordemos que parents significa padres, no parientes como algunos piensan. August 29, 2016. Place, ¿dónde va a ser? take place? Main Soccer Field En la cancha principal de fútbol Ojo que ahorita hay unas Unas preguntitas que vamos a completar sobre esto Concerts Uy, vamos a ver qué conciertos tienen allá A ver si, si no animamos a ir In this edition We have invited Famous singers Like El Charrito Negro It's, It sings Like Huasca, something like that Maluma, which is reggaeton. Donerio, which is like a disc jockey, a crazy disc jockey with strange songs. And y otros. August 28, 29, and 30, 2016. Venue, Simon Bolivar Square. That's like a, like a park. Uh, fruit contest. Contest. En este caso, con ese... 
es un concurso. Entonces vamos a ver, hay un concurso de frutas, vamos a ver cómo es. Come, ven, and see the biggest watermelons, los, los, las sandías más grandes. Algunas partes las llaman como patillas, something like that. And the sweetest oranges. Ah, um, delicious. It's very sweet. The sweetest in Antioquia. August 28, 29 and 30th, 2016. Place Bonavista Street. We have many other activities for you and plenty of surprises. So, this is visit us next August 30 to, uh, 28 to 30, 2016. Y tenemos... Algunos tenemos algunos sponsors. Sponsors significan patrocinadores. Entonces, ¿quiénes son los official sponsors of this? Antioquia's Governor's Office, Universidad de Antioquia, Maria Story, Supermarket Marjoli. So the, those are the sponsors, los que están patrocinando. Muchas veces, por ejemplo, cuando usted se va para el exterior en Australia, eh, usted se queda seis meses and after six months you need to get a sponsor necesitas conseguir un patrocinador sea que como que te garantice que puedes estar allá muchas veces es, eh, es una empresa o de que te va a dar empleo una universidad hay diferente entonces like sponsors eh, the sponsor of a team el, 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 el patrocinador de un equipo the main sponsor is here so institución educativa más welcome so entonces, basado en esto que acabo de leer y que ustedes también leyeron, entonces ahora sí vamos a ir a hacer la actividad de comprensión que la vamos a hacer juntos. Generalmente recuerden que esta actividad de comprensión las hacemos juntos. Dice, read again, pero ya enseguida les voy a compartir pantalla porque esto es un ejercicio interactivo donde vamos a mover, se llama drag and drop, drag and drop, que sería esto de acá, drag and drop. To read again, instructions, complete the following chart using the information from the activity A, traditional carnival. Arrastre la respuesta correcta a cada espacio. Entonces le voy a compartir pantalla. Recuerden que más adelante si ustedes desean, también pueden, también pueden hacer nuevamente estos ejercicios en su aula virtual. Uh, let me check. Again, vamos a ver, a veces me a veces no permite compartir pantalla. Vamos a ver si aquí me permite. Someone is going to help me. Ok, no, no, it's working now. It's working, entonces voy a aula virtual. En el aula virtual, entonces esta es una actividad, es esta la actividad de comprensión que recuerden la encontramos en la, en la semana 1 de esta unidad 3. De la primera, ustedes me van escribiendo, ojo con la participación y la com reading comprehension, ¿cierto? Que, que ustedes, allá poniendo todo de parte de ustedes, que no me hagan sentir acá muy solo, Uy, ¿qué, ¿qué hay que hacer ahí? Miren, hay una actividad, está la fecha y dónde es el lugar, entonces me tienen que decir cuál es esa primera actividad que, que tienen ahí. Por ejemplo, que se hacen August 28, 2016. ¿Dónde se hace? Where does it take place? It takes place across the whole town. Toma, se desarrolla entonces en el lugar. Entonces, voy a ir haciendo esta y, y ustedes entonces me colaboran con la segunda. Listo. Pero sí me preocupa, muchachos, la falta de participación hoy de ustedes. I'm very sad today with you with your participation. You know, I don't like comparing with them. The previous class of here, I had to stop the participation. You know what's happening with you today? I'm kind of, I'm kind of mad. I'm kind of sad. I don't know what's happening. So, ¿qué está pasando allá de pronto con la participación? Entonces, la primera sería burden. Burden is the activity that takes place across the whole town on August 28th. Entonces, August 28, 2016. En la segunda, la math race, la carrera de barro. ¿Qué fecha sería? A ver, ¿quién se acuerda de la fecha? ¿Será que me devuelvo un poquitico a la presentación? Ah, pero eh, esto no nos permite observar mucho. The math race. No, there is no way to, to do it. Muy bien, Jimmy Rendon. Hey, thank you. 
I am not talking alone. Alone. Thank you very much, Jimmy. So this is. I go back. August 29. Thank you, Jimmy. You make me very happy. At least. Number three. Number three. Que se hace en August 28th, 29th, and 30th, 2016. Entonces aquí tenemos que completar tanto la activity que se hace y la place. ¿Y qué opciones tenemos? Ya Burden lo utilizamos. Nos queda Concerts, que sería una actividad, y Takes Place at Simón Bolívar Square, pero ese sería un lugar. August 29 ya lo utilizamos. August 30, ese no lo hemos utilizado, entonces a ver si de pronto por acá, very good, de, tenemos, a ver por acá yo lo leo, Catherine, Ay, yo, yo vengo aquí para ver quién me ha escrito, para ver, very good Catherine, very good, concert, muy bien Catherine, concerts, Jimmy Rendon concerts, institución educativa Damasco y takes place at Simón Bolívar Square, Place it takes place as Simon Bolivar. I don't know. At least I can break. I can breathe because I was kind of. Yo decía, no me están escuchando. ¿Qué? ¿Qué es lo que está pasando? ¿Cierto? Entonces ahora sí. Acá en la primera, los concerts. Los concerts se van a realizar tres días: August 28, 29, and 30. And it takes place at Simon Bolivar. Takes place at Simon Bolivar Square. Square is like. En este caso serían como pequeños park, like square es cuadrado. Pero por ejemplo en Australia, Ansa so Square, que era junto donde yo estudiaba. Era como un parque ahí, la gente salía y se tomaba. Y por último, el concurso de frutas. A ver quién me... Ya, me, ya hay alguien que me, me respondió por ahí. Eh, en el concurso de frutas. Que the fruit contest, remember the biggest watermelons and the, the sweetest oranges. It takes place on Bonavista Street. So, what is the fruit contest? What is the, the last option? Si por acá hay alguien que ya me, me dijo de la última opción. Catherine and students. Catherine is de Yolombo, ¿cierto? I'm, I'm kind of confused now, Catherine. August 30. Very good, Adi. Very good. The last one. Very good. August 30. Very good. Catherine and students. It takes place on Bonavista Street. Hey, thank you very much. Thank you very, very much for that participation. So, uh, now, let's go back to the... Um, excuse me, I am, it's here. <coughs> Thank you very much. Again, we are going to chat. You are going to send me some messages about the ch by the chat. You are going to let me know what you know about... Feria de las Flores, ¿qué pasa en la Feria de las Flores? ¿Qué eventos hay? What happens in the discotheques with the concert, with the events? Let me know. A ver, alguien por allá que me diga, puede usar Spanglish if you want. Hay algunas actividades que no se pueden traducir, por ejemplo, silleteros. That's very traditional from our town. So, what happened? What happened on, on Feria de las Flores? Ustedes que han escuchado, los que han participado. ¿Qué pasa? A ver, ¿qué pasa en esa feria de las flores? Eh, talking about events, where does it take place, cuando pasan, eh, how often, cada dos meses, cada año, cada tres años, every four years, eh, the main event of this, uh, what, what are like the schedule, or what, what is planned on the flowers festivity? Yeah, Jimmy Rendon says, muestra Variedad de flores hermosas, so beautiful or different kind of flowers. Very good. That's it. Feria de las Flores. And I think the most most of all that flores come from Oriente Antioqueño, from Santa Elena. What are, it takes place every year. Very good. Institución Educativa Darío Gutierrez. Welcome again. It takes place every year, right? In which month? December, January, de pronto algún extranjero sabe después de este video o de otra ciudad y dice, eh, vámonos para las ferias de la flor en Medellín. In which, which month? January, February, March. Oh, very good. Darío Gutiérrez, he says in August. They take place in August, right? At the same time we celebrate like kind of Antioqueñidad. 
Very good. How many Hymerial Ochoan students welcome? They say we have in this feria, in this fair, or salsa, sound, concerts. Very good. Salsa. I like salsa, but I'm not a very good dancer. Uh, Maria Amparo Grajales from Amalfi and students. It's a great festivity in Medellin. It identifies people from Antioquia. Yeah, people from Antioquia feel proud of Flowers Festivity or Feria de las Flores here in Medellin. What is, what about the cars? What happened with the cars? Is there any event related to the cars? Let me know. It identifies, yeah, thank you. Uh, it's a great facility, Medellin. It identifies, yeah, very good, Maria. But a very good correction. I did. Uh, old cards, very good. There is a parade, in the field, a parade of old cars. The carros viejos, incluso los otros grandes de muy lejos. And that's a very famous parade. So, and there are hundreds of cars in that parade, and they they are very, very old, but very old, but they are, people have taken care of them with, and they are in good conditions. So, old cars, and there is a parade about this, about silletas, and there is a contest. These are celebrate Catherine in August. There are cavalcades, well, Concerts, sales, comparsas, very good, yeah. There are many, many different things. And um, sometimes los silleteros dance with their silletas in their backs. Sometimes, and there is a contest, hay un concurso about las silletas, and they choose the best ones. So, and they are very heavy, They're very heavy. They are really heavy. So, people are very happy and waste, and waste or invest, right? Waste a lot of money. They drink water, like me, and dance. Right, very good. Uh, so they drink and dance. Yeah, some people collect, algunos ahorran y ahorran because of the flowers. And let me tell you something. There are many events in the clubs, in the discotheques. There are special events related to the to the flowers festivity. So, and there are lots of concerts here, and you know, some people enjoy a lot of this. People enjoy so much in the concerts, very good. Institución Educativa Ario Gutierrez, that's totally true. Very good, hey, now you are, now you are improving now your participation, thank you very much. Now, I, it makes me very happy because at the very beginning it was, hey, what's happening? Okay, those were the, the the answers of the first one birthday, August 29, concerts. It. Cierto, este es cero. Eh, María Amparo, I admire people who are talented to do la silleta, yeah. Very good. They are good at doing that. I admire them as well. Yeah, because they dedicate a lot of time on putting each flower, and with each flower, they form like a picture, a sentence, a beautiful landscape, and that's really, that's a talent. Very good, that's a very good, that's a very good comment, Maria Amparo from, from Amalfi, very good. So let's continue. Great job, now you improve your participation. At the very beginning, I don't know what happened today. Okay, but I think, I'm sure next class is going to be totally different. La próxima clase van a empezar participando desde el principio, ¿cierto? Hoy a lo mejor llegaron un poquito, oh, what's happening, what is this? Están como un poco tímidos, like this. Okay, eh, so, before going to this, you are going to let me know, antes de, 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 de explicar esta actividad, de, de la acti eh, esta actividad guiada, que es hacer un póster invitándonos a las fiestas, van a escribir ahí, van a escribir en el chat la fiesta de su pueblo. Por ejemplo, ¿qué hay en Amalfi? ¿Qué hay en Begachí? Eh, ¿Qué hay en Institución Ocatía de Río Gutiérrez? Nos puede decir también de dónde es y qué hay. Catherine de Yolombó, ¿qué, qué, qué fiestas hay en Yolombó? Angela, eh, una de esas Angelos es de, 
Gómez Plata, ¿cierto? Institución Educativa 11B Colombia. El Consejo de la Estrella, ¿qué pasa en la Estrella? Institución Educativa de Damasco. La de Sandra, de Jimmy Rendón, de la, la, la institución de Anorí. Entonces... Me van a contar qué hay, pero en forma de un parrafito. Por ejemplo, ustedes a ver, las fiestas, por ejemplo, en Copacabana. A ver qué decían por acá, Sandra. Naranja Festival. So, let me know las fiestas del pueblo, sí, de su pueblo. Entonces, se llama la CNN de la institución educativa Masco. Pero entonces, cuéntenme algo así pequeñito en inglés, qué es lo que pasa. Por ejemplo, there are concerts, there is a traditional race, there is a traditional competition or contest, or people don't work. For example, in Barranquilla, en el carnaval de Barranquilla, they don't work. People don't work there. But here in Medellín, we work, and at the same time, we have Feria de las Flores. So, eh, Mientras me van contando ahí en un medio parrafito pequeño, la fiesta de la paz y el progreso from Amalfi. Very good. Entonces en un momento lo leo, pero en un parrafito, no solamente el nombre, sino que me, lo, me escriban la fiestica, ¿cierto? Entonces, mientras usted me van describiendo ahí, yo les voy contando que lo que hay que hacer. A carnival poster. Un poster de carnav del carnaval o de your festivity or your traditional party or festival. Invitar a través de un post de un póster, un póster es un, una cartelerita, así como las que, o un, o un plegable, así como las que yo les acabé de mostrar de la de los pájaros y las frutas. Entonces, invitar a través de, de ese póster a las fiestas de su pueblo. Instruction, design a póster inviting our characters and the rest of the community to your town carnival or fair. Mention as many details as you can. Such as activities, contests, concerts, competitions, dates, times and places where all these events will take place. Entonces me van a mencionar todo lo que pasa allá y dar tanta información como puedan. Cada uno de los detalles, las actividades, si hay concursos, sancocho competition o sancocho contest, concerts, qué tipo de conciertos, a quiénes van a invitar, pueden inventar en ese lugar o quiénes son los invitados. Miren que en el, en el otro de, de los birds, los invitados eran Don Ebrio, Maluma, el Charrito Negro, eh, you can invite people bueno, or many, o pensar en las personas adultas y también pensar, pensar en las jóvenes, o en different events, o hay tres conciertos al mismo tiempo, one for reggaetoneros, other for people who love rock, and other for popular, Colombian popular music, So, eh, competencias, ¿qué tipo de competencias hay? Entonces, por ejemplo, eh, who eats more hamburgers, who drinks more guaro, who drinks more soda, who drinks more eh, guarapo, de caña, right? Guarapo. Eh, ¿cuándo, ¿Cuándo es? Date. En December 1st, December 2nd, the first week of January, the second week of oh, September. Eh, and places y los lugares que, que eligen para esto y qué pasa with the discotheques with the clubs, with people right? y qué pasa en todo esto eso voy a leer entonces un poquitico de lo que me han ido escribiendo la fiesta del pueblo en Copacabana, Naranjo Festival Jimmy Rendón la fiesta de la paz y el progreso from Amalfi uh, I have been to that party when I was a little I used to go to To Amalfi, so many years ago, cuando era la carretera vieja, now it's closer. El Tigre Amalfi. Eh, Consejo de la Estrella de Romeral, Romerals Festival. El Romeral es como una planta, ¿cierto? Eh, de la estrella, de Romerals Party. Eh, más o menos me acuerdo porque tuve una estudiante acá en la universidad que en algún momento en una presentación habló del Romeral. Eh, so, Angela. Fiesta del cacao en Támesis. Y ahorita es que Gómez Plata o something like that. Támesis, ya. Yeah. Fiesta del cacao. Uh, la del pesebre escondido. Oh my God, it sounds interesting. What is that? Let me know. A ver, cuénteme qué es eso, el pesebre escondido. Pesebre, I don't know how to say pesebre in English. Even there is not a, a, I think there is not a word to say pesebre in English. But you can say pesebre using parentheses something like that because it's a very traditional word that we use here uh, maybe it's part of the Christmas decoration uh, 
situación que te dan ahorí. O, oh, which message? ¿Qué mensaje? A ver, cuénteme en la Nori, ¿qué hay? De pronto, acuerden que ustedes van a hacer un póster invitándome o invitando a los personajes del, del, a los personajes del, del curso, como José, como Fernanda, como Daniel y todos los que hemos ido trabajando a, a su festival. Here in Caldas, we celebrate the party of El Aguacero. Se dice que en Caldas no, ¿cómo es? No, no, no llueven, ¿cómo es? No escampa, something like that. They always, it's raining always, right? Oh, I have been to Caldas as well. It's a beautiful place. Maria Amparo, the festivity of peace and progress. It will be October 14th to 20. Six days, oh my God. Six days in a party, in a festivity, in a carnival. Oh my God, that's going to be so long. So they are really good. The parties of Hiding oh, very good. Muy bien, institución educativa Damasco. Very good. Del pesebre esconde, I don't know if that the word, I don't know. Pesebre, I don't know. We will, we will have, we will have concerts, soccer games. Oh my God, that's good. In Amalfi, they include sports in their festivities. In Yolombo, celebrates in January the Panela Party and La Marquesa de Yolombo, where makes many activities such as gastronomy, concerts, and many other things. Oh, it's really interesting, very good. I would like to go to Yolombo sometime. I don't, I have never been to Yolombo, but it sounds interesting. Maria Amparo, there will be interesting concerts, concerts and contests, very good. Institución Educativa Damasco, much drinks, yeah. Uh, Consejo La Estrella, yes, It, it's a lake in La Estrella. Ah, no era como una planta, Eso, esto del, ¿cómo es el nombre ahorita que me lo han dicho? Yo pensé que era como una planta, entonces es un lago. Ok, fiesta de la dulzura en Begachi, All right, it sounds interesting, so sweet. It's, why dulzura? Because there are many sweet fruits, sweet Drinks or beverage, something like that. If you come, you will have a good time here. Enjoy food. Hey, that's a very good sentence. And thank you. First of all, thank you. Secondly, that's a very good sentence for your poster. Miren esta oración tan buena, condicionando de forma positiva eh, la, la invitación. If you come, si vienes, you will have a good time. Here, tendrás un muy buen tiempo, disfrutarás mucho acá. And enjoy food, y vas a disfrutar de la fiesta. Y volver a subir al salto ese que hay allá, el nacimiento del agua. So, oh, institución que te llama Damasco. Es que a Damasco se le ha llamado el pesebre escondido de Antioquia. Oh my gosh. Sí, yo como que ya me acuerdo. Sí, el pesebre. Wow, sí, ya como que yo alguna vez los he ido, no he ido, pero los he leído. Que es como un corregimiento pequeño y que las casitas son todas muy parecidas y muy bonitas. Creo que de la a Damasco, sí, ya, ya me acordé. Pero esto es como, esto es en Santa Bárbara, ¿cierto? Y es un corregimiento. Oh my God, that's really good, so interesting. La estrella is better, right? All of them are... Dulzura Carnival sin Begachit. Institución Cateva Nanori celebrate the party of Antioqueñidad. Oh my God. Yeah, it would be very interesting. Antioqueñidad's party. So I guess there are a lot of morcilla, eh, all of our traditional food, I guess. No? Chorizo, sauce. Jimmy Rendón. En Amalfi se hace actividades para jóvenes y adultos de forma que todos participen. Yeah, that's the best place. That's the best activity for integrating people, right? Uh, I mean, they are separated, but at the same time, if they think about uh, an activity for the family, it would be great. But everybody enjoys those parties if they have different activities for everyone. ¿Para dónde vamos hoy? Ah, no vamos con mi papá para esto. No, vamos para donde están mis amigos. But yeah, different concerts. Very good, Jimmy. Oh my God, nos cuentan que en la estrella dura 15 días, it's during 15 days. Oh my gosh. 
15 days in Carnival's Party. When does it take place? When does it take place? ¿Cuándo pasa eso allá en la estrella? En January, February, July, September, October, November, December. To plan to go because 15 days. Oh, it's too much. Institución Educativa Gutiérrez. El Aguacero Party in Caldas takes place in October the 9th, right? Where people enjoy a lot. So, there are different activities. For example, first day, we just concerts of reggaeton. Nest, popular music. Nest, salsa. Oh my God. Darío Gutiérrez, Institución Educativa Darío Gutiérrez. So, you are going to celebrate a lot. So, very good. ¿Y está lloviendo por allá en Caldas en este momento? No, it's... ¿Y en las fiestas del aguacero? ¿El aguacero de pronto a veces daña la fiesta o no? It's just the name. Because I have heard that in Caldas it rains a lot. Yes, Damasco. O sea que si... Institución Ocatea Nori, the party during five days. So, five days in a party, in a, in, a, in a festival. That's too much as well. Here in Tamesis, cacao fur lasts one week. Seven days, so oh, that's long. And people enjoy the talent show. Very good. They have, you have a talent show. Cavalgatas and Colgate and concerts. That's really interesting. Oh my God. Hey, you make me very happy letting me know about all the things that you that you have in your parties. The only thing it's missing, que lo único que hace falta, plata y tiempo, right, to go, plata y tiempo to go, but if someday... I can, I will go. I will go because it sounds really interesting. Ricardo, hi. Hey, Ricardo, let us know about the party or festivities in your place. Let us know. Ricardo, ¿qué, qué pasa en su pueblo? ¿Qué festividades hay allá? ¿Qué es lo que, qué es lo que, qué es lo que disfrutan? Bueno, mientras ya me terminen los últimos comentarios para leer los últimos, les vuelvo a explicar entonces. Vamos a hacer un póster. Lo podemos hacer. Two people, maximum three students, and you are going to design a poster. Y algunos, pues, en este poster, algunos pueden dibujar, otros van escribiendo. Recuerden, primero diciendo eh, qué edición del poster es. Si, if the second, eh, de, del poster no, qué edición de la fe, fe, festividad es. If the second festival, the third festival, or carnival, or party, right, or fair. Entonces, welcome to the 10th festival of bonds, de los huesos. I don't know. I just, entonces, bienvenidos. Luego, we are glad to invite you. Estamos complacidos de invitarte to our festival of... Y luego nos va a decir qué va, qué va a pasar, ¿cierto? Entonces, para esto pueden usar, primero, de ejemplo, este póster que tenemos acá, miren que tiene al principio esto, donde es Welcome to our 32nd Bird and Fruit Carnival, y luego We are glad to invite you, estamos complacidos de invitarlo y que vengas uh, to come to our great town, a nuestro pueblo maravilloso, in this edition we have a lot of events planned, entonces miren acá ya nos hablan de estos que, están, que tienen planeados, y este es un ejemplo, no les olviden poner los sponsors, use your imagination. U otros ejemplos que tenemos por acá, miremos estos. Puede ser en forma de plegable, hey carnival, don't forget to smile. Entonces en este carnival nos dicen que es una fiesta de rey, que no, no, don't forget to smile. Cape Town Carnival Elementor, this is a different one, una invitación. Y ese es como la... La primera parte, pero también deben escribir lo que va a pasar, ¿cierto? Like what you have planned. A ver, acá tenemos Consejo de la Estrella. Silvestre Dangón came to La Estrella Festival the last year. Yes, I realized about it. Yes, en La Estrella. We were DJ in Damasco. Or you have DJ in Damasco. Very good. F. Gómez, in Begachi is celebrated Dulzura Carnival. People enjoy in family, walking family, dance, offer typical food. And Dulzura Carnival of Begachi is celebrated an activity called Las Delicias del Ayer. Wow. O sea, platos típicos antiguos. No, se me hace agua la boca ya con todo eso. No digamos hablando de comida. Eh, Yeah, that's no problem. That's no problem with that. You can have 
hasta el fin de semana, sí. Bueno, eh, so, entonces hacemos el, eh, este y este póster y lo entonces lo pueden hacer. Pueden hacer el póster más o menos y si quieren le toman una fotico y lo suben, lo comparten. Si solamente desean en Facebook con nuestro grupo. Eh, yo he visto, por ejemplo, muchos trabajos de algunos, por ejemplo, en la institución de Urrao, de la normal de Urrao, con la profesora Viviana Trejos, que eh, crearon un, un grupo donde van subiendo todo. And that's amazing. That's really amazing for us. I don't know. I feel really happy. I don't have a lot of time. Not mantengo mucho tiempo. But I, in my short time, I try to read you a lot. And it makes me really happy. So... Eh, Many institutions participate of the carnival in Begachi. Right, very good. So, entonces, vuelvo y repito, hacer un póster que tenga lo que tienen planeado, poner, invitando, luego despidiéndose al final los patrocinadores. Y puede ser entre dos o tres. Y recuerden que si desean, nos lo pueden compartir también por ahí. Right, this is part of the following app of your classes. Entonces, si tienen de pronto alguna duda, recuerden que yo voy a estar acá. Muchas gracias. Thank you very much for being there. Eh, it's a pleasure for me to be guiding you. Muchas gracias a todos por estar entonces hoy acá. Un saludo muy especial nuevamente a todos mis colegas allá, a los estudiantes. Y espero que la próxima clase la participación sea from the very beginning amazing. Thank you, thank you very much. Uh, even, por acá nos dicen que en Begachi hasta los niños participé, students. That's very good. Okay, thank you very much. You did a very great job. Thank you. See you on next class. If you have any doubt, please let me know. I'm going to be here. Please test me and I'm going to be answering your questions. Un abrazo para todos. Los quiero mucho. Bye-bye. Have a good day. Enjoy your activity.